Hi, I'm DYC1000, and today I'm going to show you guys how to pitch shift in your AXS24 sampler instrument without affecting the tempo. First thing you want to do is bring up your samples on your AXS24 sampler instrument. If you already have them loaded in there, you can still pitch shift without affecting the tempo. If you don't already have samples loaded in, please look at my other tutorials on, on finding out how to load samples in your, into your AXS24 sampler instrument. You want to make sure that you choose multi output for your sample instrument I already have samples loaded in here's how it sounds at the regular tempo and pitch now the great thing about the EXS24 sample instrument is that you can copy and paste your samples on the, on the, onto other keys now make sure you have your Zone highlighted, your sample highlighted on the top part of your AXS24 sample instrument. Go to edit, choose copy. Then go to edit again, choose paste. Now that copy is an, uh, an exact copy of that same sample above the previous sample. Just drag that sample onto the key right next to it or wherever key you want to place it on. Same sample. Just push it up a little higher. You can't really tell because it's so close together. But make sure you go to, to where it says playback and unclick the pitch button if it is clicked on. Unclick it. Next thing you want to do is go to where it says mixer and output. Now you can assign each sample to a different output on your on your mixer or a different auxiliary. For our second sample, we're going to assign it to three and four. Now if we go to where it says mixer in our arrangement arrangement window it's gonna say default one which is denoting number one our EXS24 sample instrument it also says it in the IO area and it says instrument one. Now if you notice it has the plus sign which is a uh, indicator that it's a multi output uh, instrument which I notified you you had to assign it in the beginning. Click on plus it adds auxiliary three and four, which is the sam which is where the second sample is located on. Three and output three and four. Now we're gonna go to inserts, go to audio units, go to Apple, go to AU pitch, and we're gonna manipulate the pitch. If you listen right now, both samples are on the same pitch. I'm going to chipmunk the second sample up a little bit. So we have two samples at different pitches, but at the same tempo. That's a quick and easy way to pitch shift your samples without affecting the tempo in your EXS24 sample instrument. If you have any other questions, feel free to shoot me an email.